then we need sticks. We need one stick for right now. Excellent. And then we need a rubber band. Okay. Excellent. Step one. Match tab A on the circuit board. See over here. See how it says A on the circuit board? It's A on the circuit board. Look at your circuit board. Oh, on this. See on the here. circuit board? And line it up. Um, poke the tab through the slanted slot so the arrows point the same way on the game board. Okay, so let's look on the game board until you see on the game board where it says A. This? Yeah. Where does it say A with an arrow? A. There you go. Now line it up with the A over here with the arrow here. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Look how, look how it lines up here. So let's look at the pieces. Let's see if there are pieces that look like they should go together. Okay, kind of like a puzzle. Which part of this fits into a part like this near where the A is? Or where the A is pointing. Yeah. Oh, here. Ah, excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. That's excellent. Next. Ah, so look. They said make sure it's like this. Make sure that the brads are pointing down. Right? And are they pointing down? Yes. Good. Perfect. Because they're going to go down here. Exactly. The balls are going to go that way so that they can complete these circuits. Right? Next, step two. Hook a black ring around the tab to hold it in place. You see how they put the black ring on the, uh, on the outside over there? I'm going to push it through while you put that on. holding it in place. Next, step three. Match up tab B with the ta with the tab B on the circuit board on the uh, on the game board. And do the same thing. Excellent. I'm gonna hold it for you. And then this. And then you got that. Excellent. Slide the M piece onto the circuit board so that the legs of the M should go between the foam.